In this first episode, I'm going to be unboxing my new Ender Free Pro 3D printer and printing my very first print, the 3D Benchy Boat. My printer arrived in the post which I bought online through Creality's website. Link is in the description. The Ender Free Pro costs £133, with the previous version, the Ender Free, costing only £115. I decided to buy the popular printer after reading such great online reviews and talking to friends who have the printer. Since making the video and using the printer, I would agree that this is a great product. It's very cheap, it prints high quality prints and can print in a variety of material filaments. Just to make clear, I'm not sponsored by Creality or anyone else. After receiving the printer in the post, I had to assemble the separate components. I have not shown this step, but with the help of the manual, some online videos, the manual which came with the printer, I was successfully able to put the 3D printer together in two to three hours. With the printer comes a small reel of PLA filament. However, this will not last long. So I decided to buy some white PLA filament from Geetech. Then continue to gently push the filament through the white cable until it reaches the extruder. You're going to need to download the Ultimator Cura software, which is free. Cura is an open source slicing software, which allows you to fine tune your 3D model with over 400 plus settings. You need to briefly use the software after you have downloaded the file, which you wish to print. Other slicing softwares are available. Now you'll need to go to the website Thingiverse. Thingiverse is a website dedicated to the sharing of user-created digital design files, providing primarily free open source hardware design files. On the website, you will find free files, which allow you to print phases, glasses, face shields for coronavirus, toys, household items, and more. For this video, we are going to be searching for the 3D Benchy boat file. We're going to hit the download all files button. Then you're going to see the pop-up on the top right of your screen. Open files and click on the first 3D Benchy files. If you have downloaded and installed the Cura software successfully, you will see the blue Cura logo next to the file. Now open the file and you will see the 3D Benchy boat file open in Ultimaker Cura. Cura gives you a 360 degree view of your file. Left click on standard quality. It will open up your 3D printing settings. If you are new to 3D printing and using PLA plastic, then you can copy these settings which will give you a successful print on most prints. However, you will learn how to create supports for more unique shaped and overhanging items. This is easy to use and I will show you more in future videos. Now left click again on standard quality and now we are going to hit the slice button. This translates the file into a format which can be recognized by the 3D printer. 3 hours and 34 minutes. This is the time taken for the printer to print the file. 11 grams is the amount of plastic used to create the file. If you are happy with that, then you can hit save. However, I would like to make my size slightly smaller. Now click on the scale button and change the number from 100% to 50%. Now you can see that the Benchy boat is 50% smaller than before. Hit the slice button. Now it only takes 53 minutes to print and only two grams of plastic. Put your memory card slash USB stick, which came with the printer into your PC and hit save to removable drive button. Now that your file is saved onto your memory stick, hit eject. 
Take the macro SD memory card out of the USB stick and now place the card into your 3D printer. Make sure that your 3D printer is plugged into the wall. Press the on switch on the side of the printer. Scroll clockwise and press the button prepare. Scroll down to preheat the PLA and down again to preheat PLA. Now we wait until the extruder and print bed have reached the correct temperature. The bed needs to reach 45 degrees Celsius and is currently at 28 degrees and the extruder is currently at 45 degrees and needs to reach 185. You can see the Ender 3 printer's print bed. This is where the material is laid down. The cube shaped object is the extruder. This propels, guides and melts the filament through the small nozzle at the bottom. Now that the print bed and extruder have reached the correct temperature, scroll down to print from TF. Sometimes you have to press on change TF card first. Scroll down to the file which you want to print, in this case 3D Benchy. Temperature of 60 degrees for the bed and 185 degrees for the extruder. You may see the PLA begin to come out. You can either ignore this or very gently remove this whilst keeping your hand far from the nozzle. Now that the Ender 3 has reached its final temperature, the print will begin automatically. The actual time took 53 minutes. Here is a 45 second time lapse of the 3D Benchy boat printing.